I was really young when I started drawing. So. And I had no idea like where it would take me. And it was just a hobby at first, you know, and over time it evolved into something more. Japanese art, I wouldn't just say Japanese art, I would say East Asian. Like that's where most of my influence comes from. And like I, like I said earlier, uh, when I was younger and I was watching Dragon Ball Z and uh, I watched a movie called Spirited Away and it's by a director named Hayao Miyazaki. And I like did a lot of research just looking it up. And after I found like the footage and the behind the scenes, that's when I started like all my influences started to come from Asia. Like I just fell in love with it. They had tatami mats, um, sliding doors, and a lot of things that we don't have. And I think opposites attract. So I was just drawn to it. Chronologically over the years, started off just like watching cartoons. And after watching the cartoons, especially the East Asian cartoons, I just emulated the styles, drawing it that way, and I was just copying, you know. And then after that, it was, okay, let's see if I can make my own characters using this style that I've already learned, you know. And then I started drawing with ink, and just ink. And I wouldn't let myself use a pencil. I couldn't erase anything, and I had to, like, just rock with it. Um, so after a while, like, all the imperfections and all of the um, mistakes that I made with the pen, those became like where the evolution started and after that you know it just took off and I learned different trades and I learned how to use the computer I learned printmaking and that's how I am where I am today everyone's goal in life is to do something they love doing and generate revenue doing it you know so like if I can I would love to make art every day of my life and just make money. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I can make money just doing what I love, I, I just unlock the code, you know? Um, it's like, you, I never work a day in my life. I play all the time and get paid for having fun, you know? So don't work hard during the weeks. You can have fun on the weekends. I would suggest going for what you want to do. I, I just know that 2016 is my year. I say that every year. Cause every year is my year because I claim it. And... I think it's just mind over matter. And Luke, if you talk to Luke too, my brother, um, he's like even further along than I am. Like he knows exactly why he's been put on earth. It's just, we're just here to create, you know, like that's, create and then serve God too.